and the trigger. Aww. Okay, so now if we take, we'll set this puppy out here. Well, we'll, we'll, we don't need it. So what I did find out is the first time you uh, look through it, so I'm going to right click. Boom, baby. You zoomed in. Now, you can see where it says there, Brett. Greetings, 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 I would say. Good, I hope, right, today's mod is called the Hunt Mod. Should appear up there in a second. Why well, it does? Well, it adds all kinds of hunting stuff to your game. It adds some really, really cool guns, rifles and shotguns. It also adds some really awesome traps. It adds a new biome, and it also adds a new mob. A deer, so you can go out there hunting. You don't have to just hunt the deer. You can hunt villagers, hunt your friends, hunt anybody you want. 1.12.2, let's get into it and have a look, shall we? Right. So there's a few things you need to craft and need to decide. I, I we're just doing some testing here. These these are the traps. I'll show you how to craft them in a minute. You can craft two different kinds. A normal one or points of one. And uh, obviously they'll trap the deer. That's the new mob in the game. The deer there. I'm just seeing if they trap villagers. They'll also trap me if I walk on that. <laughs> so I, I'll be a bit careful. But let me just show you what we've got. And then I'll show you all the crafting recipes. Then we'll go into the new biome. And oh, there's also, it says, some hidden chests with really good loot. So you know what I mean? I might even show you where they are. Or you might have to download it and look for it yourself. Anyway, so... Hunting rabbit. It describes it describes everything there. Uh, high damage, long range. You can see whatever it, what it says. Obviously, it's crafty hunting rifle. I'll show you that in a second. These are the hunting rifle bullets. They're crafted quite easy. You get eight for two bits of iron. That's another good thing about this mod. It's not really really expensive. Okay, I'll show you the crafting recipes in these in a sec. They're all pretty similar, just mixed around a bit. Okay, so you have got the shotgun. All right, the shotgun shells crafted like so. You're gonna get four. So that's a little gold nugget. That's not too bad. Gunpowder's not too bad. Because you can shoot creepers with these. Okay, he says what he does there. Um, high damage only at close range because it's a shotgun. Okay, okay. Next one here, hunting revolver. You can see that. Medium damage, short to medium range. All right. They take, obviously, the revolver rounds. Crafted like so. So you're just going to get... It's quite a few. When you first craft a gun, it will be fully loaded for you. And then all you have to do to have, to reload it is make sure you've got the right bullets for the right gun in your inventory. When you click on it, it'll load it all up for you. I'll show you that in a second. I'm going to show you everything. Don't you worry. Just get sorted it for you. But anyway, if you want to craft uh, some of the revolver rounds, three bits of iron, three bits of gunpowder. Okay. Now, this is a hunting knife. Now, you need this to carve the deer up to get, as you can see down here, the different kind of meats and that. I think you must be able to find this because there's no crafting recipe for it. And I know it's an early, early, well, it says it's early anyway, so there might be some bits and bobs not quite implemented yet. But there is no crafting recipe for the knife, but you need the knife so you can cut the deer up. I'll show you in a minute, because when you kill the deer, it doesn't just naturally drop the meat. It lays on its side, and you have to go up to it with the knife, which I'll show you, and cut it down. And then you'll put, you put um, that raw venison in your crafting table with the knife, and you'll get some raw venison jerky. And then you put that in the... Um, in your furnace, I can't think for saying it. In your furnace, and then you'll uh, you'll have a uh, uh, what's it called? Cooked jerky. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And also you can cook the uh, venison as well. All right. There it is. Right. Also two traps in the game. Okay. So there's a normal trap, crafty like so, nice and cheap. Three bits of iron, two traps. Okay. And the other trap is a poison trap. It is like, and that's crafty like so. So it's obviously any splash potion or a normal potion. All right. And the poison trap. That's just to catch them and poison them. Obviously. <laughs> that's why it's a poison trap. Okay, I don't know if if after you've, because obviously it traps the animal there. We'll, we'll shoot that in a second. Hello, I'm getting you on me. Hey, it should be with Santa. But anyway, we'll shoot that in a second. Like I said, it will trap anything. I trapped a villager there. He's not moved. Obviously, he's stuck on there. Take a little bit of damage at the beginning. What's he took? He took half a half a heart. One and a half hearts of damage. And that took one and a half. So it takes one and a half hearts of damage. When you stand on that, we'll be a bit careful. Let me show you the crafting recipes for the gun. So you've got the revolver here. Like I said, they all use the same kind of pr principles. But if you want to craft yourself the uh, hunting revolver, first thing you have to craft is the barrel. Okay, craft it like that. Dead easy, dead cheap. Love it. Love it because it's cheap, not 15,000 diamonds for, you know what I mean? Yeah, I love it. Okay, the revolver body, like that. So what's that? Up to now we've used, what, uh, six, nine, and the revolver handle is that. Two bits of leather. No, so it's ten, ten bits of iron and two bits of leather, and you've got yourself a revolver. Okay, next one here. Pretty cool one, the shotgun. Okay, you're going to craft the gun barrel like so. Okay, that's going to crafting recipe. Uh, crafting recipe. I have to go to your crafting table in this way. Okay, then you want the shotgun body. Still nice and cheap. Okay, gun stock and the trigger. Like so. Last but not least, and the best one out of all, the best one out of all, the hunting rival. First thing, this is how you put it in your crafting table when you craft it. But first thing you have to craft is craft yourself the scope, obviously. Craft it like that. So that's at six iron ingots and two bits of glass, two panes of glass. Okay, then you're going to go to the barrel. We've already seen rifle barrel like that. Still cheap. Gun stock. 
and the trigger. Okay, so now if we take, we'll set this puppy out here. Well, we, we, we don't need it. So what I did find out is the first time you uh, look through it, so I'm going to right click. Boom, baby, you zoomed in. Now you can see where it says there, breath. Okay, if I if I just go dead still, right? If, let's go. Where's it did? There it is, right? So I hold dead still. You see how it's moving around on your own. So your normal shift key that you normally you know squat down or when you creep into the edge of a cliff. If you hold that down, it takes a breath and stops moving. See, then your breath goes back up. Okay, so <gasps> like that. So we take a breath. So, so you know you can get you. I mean, to be honest with you, at this range, if you miss, <laughs> it's a bit crap. So I'm gonna take my breath. Okay, and then look, fire, boom, baby, and it's dead. So it does look like you get the trap back. This is what I'm talking about. I mean, do, do you see that for animation? Wait, wait for it. I didn't make the gun go across my body again. There, look at that. Look at that. That's awesome. The way that looks. That, that's that's proper. Anyway, so that's when you've killed it. When you kill a normal wolf, obviously that just drops where it normally drops. But this dies like this. This is where you need the knife. Like I said, there's no crafting recipe for the knife. All you do then is you go up and you're going to right click on it. Boom, baby. Hopefully it won't go outside. You see how it's dropping bits out of it. And you get stuff in your inventory. And then obviously you, you, you put your knife in your crafting table to get your jerky. Or you can just cook your venison like normal. Can you reset the traps? You might be able to pick them back up. I should imagine you could pick them back up. In fact, to be honest with you all, let's, um, let's kill the villager. Boom, baby. So it's hovering, it's hovering around. If I press the shift key, <gasps> take a breath. Boom. Dropped him. Okay, let me just change my game mode because I want to know if we can pick that back up. I should imagine you can. I should imagine there are one time, one hit. Am I going to need. The question is, am I going to need an axe to do it? Hmm. Let me just get myself a pickaxe because we need to know this, don't we? We'll go straight to a diamond pickaxe. Boom, baby. Diamond pickaxe. Yes, you can pick them back up. I thought you would be able to. I mean, you know what time one use. And then you just, when you want to put them down, you're just going to right click like normal and then down there. And obviously, anything that spawns and strolls across it, you can lay a load of them out, spawns and strolls across it, it's going to get trapped. Right. Enough of that. Let's never cross into this new biome. Let's show you these new structures, the new biome, what you're looking for. And like I said, the deers only spawn in this biome. Now, when you're in normal mode, not creative, the deers will run away from you. So you've got to be a bit, but you know what I mean? A bit stealthy, a bit quiet. Cheese case, I'm not good at quiet. So uh, I'll be in creative anyway. See you in a second. Right, like magic, here we are in a new world. So just uh, obviously created a new world, just like you would do normally. You have to go out and you have to find the biome because the, the deers will not spawn in any other biome. Well, I've not seen them spawn in any other biome. So you're looking for a biome that looks like this. So they're quite easy to find because you just look at the trees. And I tell you what, it wasn't hard to find either. That's a birchwood, obviously. I don't, know if it's, I don't know if they always spawn near birchwood biomes. But anyway, th that's what you're looking for. You see a tree like this, you know there's going to be deer around here. If we go across here, obviously I set my bed here. These are the little structures you get. There's a deer there, look. These little structures that are around. Now, there's loads of these dotted around. Now, it does say some hidden chests and some really good loot around here. So, I mean, it could be underneath there, to be honest with you. Or it could be just there. Or it might not even be there at all. And you might have to look somewhere else. I'm not going to show you because that's part of the fun of it finding out. But there's loads of them. You don't go to think yourself, oh, I ain't going to find a way to structure up. There's another one here. Okay. There's, you know what I mean? Like I say, that could be sitting on top of a chest. Who, who knows? What you need to do is you need to go out and find it. And like I said, he says on the what's name. Let me just read it. It says, uh, uh, structures can provide shelter while exploring and contain some loot. Some chests are also hidden containing better loot. Okay, so, I mean, I've not seen a chest out in the open, to be honest with you. I mean, I've, I've had a good look around. I found loads of them little structures. Yeah, there's another one over there. Let's have a quick look. I've not found a chest out and about. I mean, they might not just necessarily be in these structures. They might be just... Laying around like normal. Let's just, let's just run around for a second. Pick some bits and bobs up. Look, here's another structure here. But I do know there's hidden ones. Where they're hidden? Who knows? Could be around here somewhere. Could be under there. You could be looking for half a slab. Cheesecake, I want to tell you. Because of the tease. Let's have, a, let's have a look around. But I've not found a chest just laying around. I'll have a truth with you. I've not seen one laying around. We'll have, we'll have a quick... Well, 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 we've got a few seconds. We'll have a quick look around and uh, see. Like I said, none of these structures are hard to find once you find the biome. And the biome, to be honest with you, is not that hard to find. These cheese kept running around. We don't need to be running around. We've got fly mode. We've got cheat mode on. Yeah, well, there's another structure. Hmm. I don't know. That's what it says. Let me just read it again. Uh, some chests are also hidden. Right, it says, um, provide shelter when exploring and contain some loot. Alright, some. 
If I was in normal mode, you wouldn't be that close to me. Yeah. So, you have to let me know if you if, if you've downloaded this and have a look and you find a chest lying around. Or if you find a chest in here and you want to help somebody out, leave it down in the comments below to help other people out. But if not, download the mod. Go and have some great fun. Get some guns. Me personally, like I said, get the, um, let's get the, uh, let's get the rifle. Let's get the let's get the rifle out, shall we? You can't. Uh, the rifles, the shotgun's pretty good, but it's only good like at distance. You can't beat the rifle. If I just, uh, oh man, I think I don't need it. So if we just uh, now, sometimes you see how it's done that. You just do that sometimes. I don't know why that is. Let me just. There we go. I, I notice if you look up at the sky, then it clears it. So if you get it and it goes flat like that, there's a deer, right? And all you're all you're doing is you're not you're not left mouth clicking. All you do is you take your breath and you let your finger off. Boom, baby. And you shot it. Okay, so it's right trigger to zoom in. Right trigger. <laughs> right mouse button to zoom in. And then when you want to fire, you just take your finger off it and you shot. And like I said, when you want to take a breath to stop it from moving around. So if we, if we look at, see how it's moving around there. Okay. So press shift. I'm holding my breath. I'm holding breath. Getting the best shot. And that's all there is to it, really. Really, really cool. Awesome. Ooh, look at that in my hand. Look at that in my hand. Look at the size of it. Boom, baby. Zoomed in your face. Yeah, and that's it. So download the link in the description. It will be in the description down there. Believe me. Just sort for all the rest of the stuff put in there. And you'll see it at the bottom. You need the newest version of Forge. Have a look around. Tell me if you, if you do download this mod. Tell me if you find a chest lying around in the uh, in the open. Because I got a deal later on its side. I love that. Yeah, if you do. Because I, I, I didn't find one. And uh, if you want to. If you want to support it for everybody else. Tell them where the hidden chests are. But me personally, I won't do that. You take care. Have a nice day. And I'll see you next one. Me, I'm going hunting. Because i tell you what. Gun. Deer, food, oh my god, that was close. And uh, and the love of the world, it's cheesecake roads all over. Bear cheesecake. <laughs> See you later. Bye.